Hey, what's happening? It's ya, bois, go, de. Smell good? If you knew, all we do is set it down all day, every day. If that interests you, consider subscribing. Show your boy some love. All my returning subscribers and family members, appreciate y'all. All my new subscribers and family members, appreciate y'all rocking with me. We are the Shut It Down family. And we come through, it's over with, man. <laughs> it is what it is, baby. But look, guys, I have a very special video, guys. Shout out to my sub, man, King Erxus. I would have smooth looked over this fragrance, man, in one of my rack store videos. And that's why I love those videos, guys. Guys, when I ask for your feedback, guys, I'm just not asking for ass sex. I take notes, guys, and I'm glad I took this note. Guys, we have <laughs> El Dorado Kingdom, Pour Om. Now, this is from the House of Kamara. They are doing their thing in the rack stores along with Milestone and those other houses, guys, and they are doing a fantastic job. This fragrance is absolutely amazing guys but in my video he was like man that kingdom and i would have missed it because it's black on black kind of matte it's kind of blended in y'all know how it is in the rack stores they're all just kind of blended in a little bit so it's kind of hard to see them i smooth overlooked it that's why i always ask those rack stores hey you see something i'm overlooking that i haven't discussed prior point it out man and i'm glad he did guys this is a clone let me say this slowly you may want to write this down this is a clone of by Killian's Straight to Heaven. Yes, that fragrance is $290 retail. I even went to the disrespectful Joma shop. I call them the disrespectful Joma shop because of those prices. Even at the Joma shop, $179 for the 50 mil. Okay, <laughs> translation, the little bottle. Well, we have a 100 mil right here. Guys, for what? $14.99, guys. Listen. Guys, and this puppy here, great quality, fantastic quality. Guys, I'm going to put them. I'm going to put them on paper first, and then, you know, I'm going to put them in the air. Here we go, guys. Man. Pressurized atomizer. Look. That's lovely. That is lovely, guys. I don't want to get none on my jacket. Cause this is not gonna be my fragrance today, guys. <laughs> it's commanding a presence, guys. This is a presence commander, but this is a mysteriously presence commander. Put them on paper, guys. There is no alcohol blast. There is no syntheticness, guys. I don't work for Camera. They don't pay me to say that, guys. I am telling you what's up. If you see this in your local rack stores, your local Marshalls for $14.99, of course, they're unboxed. See for yourself, because it may not be a year of jam. But guys, when I put it in the air at Marshalls, guys, it was love at first sniff, guys. Listen, let me just, let me go over the notes, okay? Top notes, jasmine, fruity notes, nutmeg. Middle notes, rum and patchouli, guys, if you're familiar with Killian. If not, I can tell you. Killian Hennessy, listen, all those fragrances have some form of rum or some type of boozy nature. Some are more boozy forward, some are in the background, okay? So the middle notes, rum and patchouli. Base notes, musk, amber. I love all things amber. Virginian cedar, I love cedar, guys. Vanilla, which I'm starting to love, and oud. Now, the only difference is in the El Dorado, it says oud. I don't get any oud, guys. Okay, I don't get any oud at all. And then instead of fruity notes for the Bikelian, um, it has dried fruit notes. Okay, so that's the only difference. Every other note is exactly the same. Okay, they were going for a Bikelian's <laughs> straight to heaven clone, guys. And listen. Listen, guys. It's, it's so well blended, guys. Like, I can't even say, oh, this is this woody note here or this spicy note here. What I can tell you, my couple of times I tested it, I do get the boozy accord. I get more of a boozy accord than anything, okay? 
if you like boozy fragrances you will like this fragrance but it's not like loud boozy you're not going to smell like a gallon of rum but it's just a boozy accord with everything else mixed in incredibly well guys i can't pick it apart this is a player made fragrance guys this guy here is mysteriously handsome okay this guy they really can't figure this guy out they trying to but they can't you know he's not an open book you know, he doesn't tell all his business. This guy is a, is a private guy, but he's a respectable guy. You feel me? He's a fun-loving guy. He likes to have fun and laugh, but he doesn't open up and tell you everything. This guy has healthy boundaries, okay? <sighs> Guys, let me put him in the air. I mean, I put him in the air earlier, but you know. Let me put them in the air, air. Playboy. Hey, by Killians are, are uh, known to be unisex. Playgirl. You know, you might like this, baby. Listen. Sweet. Sweet with some booze on it. Not a candy sweet, but more of a drier sweet. Probably coming from that fruit note listed. The fruit note and the boozy note is what I get more than anything and you see it, it got kind of like a flash style i kind of tell you what they're going for right there with that flask you know little drink bottle <laughs> but yeah man i really like it man shout out to king x's man appreciate you i would have smooth overlooked that guys 14 dollars 15 dollar high quality <laughs> by killian clone <laughs> guys by killian clone in your local marshals guys i can't make this up man all right well listen man thanks for taking time out of your day to watch my video it's greatly appreciated on the way out if you can help your boy with a like this does help the channel grow comment subscribe share your boy because sharing is caring and go these going global a little bit more on this fragrance guys now of course, we're in the winter time, guys, fall, winter. So seasonality, I can't give it to you. It's very new to my fragrance wardrobe. I can't give you seasonality. You know, I would assume spring and it doesn't. I think you could probably wear this in the summer, man. It doesn't seem like it would be too much in the summertime. However, the crowd on this, I would say 30 and up, 35 and up. Not that it smells like an old man, but it, it does have a, a boozy note. And it really doesn't put me in mind of a, of a young man, I would say 18 or 25. Not that you can't wear it, of course you can wear it, but it doesn't put me in the mindset of a man 18 to 25, okay? Now the dress code on this, guys, I would do this kind of man with a nice polo, man. This guy wears a nice polo. Guys, size down, fit over fashion, guys. It just has to fit. Size down, a nice polo, guys, some dark wash jeans and some monk strap shoes with some loafers with this guys black polo blue jeans and black lovers with this on it is over i'm telling you what's up man all right all right guys well thanks again for watching guys let me give you one more boozy boozy fruity guys and this is what i thought my uh angel man nebula you know from uh angel star man nebula from Fragrance Road, which is a clone of Pure Malt by T. Hetty Mugler. This is what I thought that was going to smell like, fruity and booze, but that was more woody, masculine, woody, woody, heavy with booze behind it. This is fruit and booze, baby. Live. I like it. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace.